So just to go into climate, we have a, we're right between the ocean on both sides. It's the cold Atlantic Ocean, which keeps us nice and cool during the summer. It means we have a very long kind of harvest period. So the Van der Constance today, we can pick for three months, 27 different batches, which is crazy. So long period, it is dry during harvest, but we're also able to, because of the nature of the muscat, we're able to raisin out the muscat into a point that you can pick individual perfect raisins to make that sweet wine. Um, with the cooler climate, you also get the great pH, which means that the acidity is coming out from very early raisining of the, of the berries. So at that point, you're raisining sugar and acidity together to give you that perfect balance. Um, you can see a picture of the bush vines on, on the picture to your, your bottom left. Those are also very important to the style of, of muscat that we're making today. That's actually something on plant. But, but you also have two different type of trellising, right? So uh, you use the bush vine and you use the trellised vines. What are the differences when it comes to the style? Why do you do that? So trellis vines are more of modern age. I mean, it's what we used to in, in modern winemaking in South Africa or I guess the rest of the world. Bush vines themselves would have been the way that they planted the vines in the old days. And what we're looking for is the combination between the two. So bush vines themselves, because of the shape of the vine, you can kind of picture it like this. You get a lot more sunlight penetration into the bunch zone is exactly what we're looking for to uh, harness that raisining kind of characteristic. So if you look at the shape, you're getting sunlight into this zone over here. You're getting a reflection of the soil as the soil because it's so close to the ground. And hence your raisining happens very early in the season. And it's kind of, I like to equate it to a straw wine as in you take a straw and you harvest it, you put it out into the straw or to the mat and you're concentrating very high acid levels and very high sugar levels because it's picked quite early in the season. Bush wines do exactly the same as they, they accelerate that raisining process because of the, the concentration of sunlight that they're getting and, and solar radiation. So they're raising really early in the season. Whereas trellis vines are more traditional, so they take a very long time to slowly ripen out into a point that they form raisins. So we try and, uh, can we currently 70% trellis vines, 30% bush vines. We try and get the combination right between the two to get that very nice balance of natural acidity, lovely complexity from the trellis vines with all the sugar that we need to make a great sweet one.